Hidden Object Guru here with West of Red, the new game from Anpa.us. I don't know if you, and uh, probably Racing Brothers as well. I don't know if you've followed my Journey into Madness videos, but uh, Enemy HP Bar, Cartoon Shader, ooh, Infinite Health, Unlimited Ammo, Cliche Voice Comments, what? Perks, Ammo Drops, Health Drops, Cooldown Time, Wave Size, Difficulty. So they make first person shooters, and in those first person shooters, what? <laughs> apparently they've decided to make a western themed game uh so usually uh, their games involve me shooting animals or dinosaurs or both or really whatever stock enemy assets they can uh, buy okay what all right so i got a machete and a revolver i got a wild west shotgun check out the abandoned saloon so a uh, fun fact what is this? Can I interact? I found a coat, everybody. I found a... Uh, what do you call it? Oh my god, it's the saloon again! Alright, this is a saloon that you can buy on a... Um, uh, okay. I, I agree. That you can buy in an asset at store that I found, and I have seen it in three games now, and I hope to see it in a hundred more. Every time I walk in now, I immediately recognize this saloon, because of that stove there, the arrangement of the bar, the two staircases, the stairs outside, and of course the uh, the upstairs area. And this is this might be the painting every other place is, like, it always comes with a different painting. Okay, they're really having trouble navigating me through there. Object if you hear a voice. Some of my imps are obsolete. Kill them or I will take their soul! Oh, I already love this game's plot so much. Oh, wait, and now we're just I being... I went to see the doctor about my short-term memory problems. No. Okay, it's weird that he stopped talking there. So is this yet another game where the, uh, where that saloon counts as a hub? Okay, I have 6 bullets out of 45, the damage is 225, and I have 36 targets. What? Oh my god, I'm so happy right now. Let's see what the reloading animation is. The reloading animation is surprisingly good. Do I have to pick up the ammo or do I just have to walk over it? I didn't get any ammo. Super jump activated! So this is a thing. I have 33 more guys to kill. And what is going on with the skybox? Are, are we on a Halo world? Is this a Halo spinoff? Oh my god, that makes me so happy. Apparently the scorpions also count as imps. So now you've seen the uh, cornerstone. No, I forgot to reload. Oh, this is getting bad. Uh, the cornerstone of the anpa.us visual style, which is when you shoot enemies, pieces fly just everywhere. Also, walking directly through trees is kind of a cornerstone of their visual style as well. But the, the real one that I've always taken with me is being... Uh, Okay, it's not a great animation, but they're they're working at it. And it's a decent model they found for themselves. How's my ammo doing? Oh, I got plenty of ammo. I mean, it'd be better if I actually tried to hit enemies, but you know. What? Uh, yeah, so what'll often happen is there'll be enemies. Oh, hey! A perk! Ow, ow, ow. Is Super Jump the only perk? Because I'm not saying I'm, that would make me sad or something, but, you know, it wouldn't be fantastic. Also, where's my health? Oh, it's over there. It's 120. Apparently these guys decided to start running away from me. Which I don't blame them. I mean, I am great. But, like, are we going to get to the edge of the map at some point? Or Oh, good, I have a sprint button. 
which makes me only slightly faster than they are. How do I keep missing? Ah, whatever. The early bird may get the worm, but the second mouse gets the cheese. Wait, what? Oh, because uh, of mouse traps. I understand what you're saying. I don't think I've got 92 kills. It says 92 kills and 61 headshots, but I, and I can't stress this enough, only killed 35 guys. So, how does that work? Anyway, a boss is coming, so I'm gonna... Oh, I ran out of super jump. How sad. So yeah, that's their whole thing. You shoot guys, pieces of the guys fly everywhere, and it's, uh, and it's visually thrilling. This is another a hallmark of the Anpa du US look. Uh, excessively long amount of time waiting for enemies to appear. There we go. Alright, it's a Naga. Who has no animation of any kind. That's fine. <laughs> well, yes and no. Oof. I see what you meant by cliche dialogue, guys. Uh, they've given up on that thing where they gave you 6,000 um, trophies for every level. So that's a twist. Alright, plot part two. I have not seen any weapons attached to cactuses. I, I have not. Is that is that a thing that we meant and then it got left out? How did I go from the saloon to a church? Is there some significance? And I love the lens flare coming off of those uh, uh those candles. Also the madness sky out there. <laughs> These guys just went nuts with the visual effects this time, didn't they? Oh, good. There's a windstorm going on outside. But what are you talking about weapons attached to cactuses? So yeah, Cold Iron used this uh, saloon. A little game called Cemetery. Nice. Uh, Unforgiven used this saloon. It's very popular. But yeah, I haven't seen any weapons attached to cactuses. I legit have no idea what they're talking about. Is that a crowbar? No, it's just a piece of rope, which I cannot pick up, even though it's highlighted in red like the other pick upable items are. What's that out over there? Here are the weapons attached to cactuses. I was wrong. I apologize. Uh, I would like the repeater, repeating Henry rifle, please. I've already got the other two rifles and the machete. Oh, crap! I just got rid of the rifle by grabbing the machete. And there's no way to swap back, are there? Because I wasn't dropping anything in the ground. Oh, well, that's too bad. Let's go find the Undertaker. And shoot him. I'm kidding. We're just going to go say hi. Don't know why I stopped to dead in my tracks there. That was weird. Alright, Undertaker. Do you have some, some advice to offer about what we're, what we're doing? Oof. Sure. Uh, so apparently I'm in a uh, hypothetical goes. western town. Power is the audio for their cliched lines tends to get cut off. Which is weird. Those, are, those aren't balloons, those are Chinese lanterns that the developers have made here! <laughs> huge and just dropped in the sky this is a problem when the uh, bad guys make no moving sound effects whatsoever it's very easy to get snuck up on or sneaked up on depending on how you're supposed to say that word do I have super jump I do have super jump you know it'd be really useful with super jump it would be a uh, like a grenade of some kind 
Uh, I gotta say, I'm enjoying this more than a lot of their games, and I'll tell you why. Uh, because I only have to shoot the enemies once to kill them. That whole thing they were doing where it's like, we got more challenging enemies now. Uh, I want you to sprint around and shoot all the enemies 800 times to kill them. That got old fast. I'm trying to focus on the scorpions the first time now. What the hell? <laughs> that being said, there was some joy to be found in uh, the way when there were like 800 enemies. Sorry, enemies that took 800 bullets. They would shoot off fountains of body parts as you killed them. Start a fight with somebody when they have the hiccups. I did. I did enjoy that. All right. Start a fight with somebody when they have a what? Well, at least this boss enemy is decent enough to uh, appear. Is that him? What? Like, at least a Naga is more impressive than the monsters that were chasing you. I went to see the doctor about my short-term memory problems. The first thing the monster did was make me pay in advance. Oh, okay, so that was the joke. Are there only five missions in this game? Is this game only 20 minutes long? Wait, I thought the devil wanted me to be his enforcer, and so he was having me shoot monsters to find that out. Uh, I assume I have to go find the sheriff this time? Ah, here we go. Oh, my grave! Alright. So yeah, we are in purgatory, uh, making a deal with Satan. Now I want to get every cheap, well not cheap, but, you know, budget priced indie Old West game and see if, how many of them have that saloon in them. Oh, Apparently, Satan is something of a charmer. Green is my favorite color. I, I forgot to go and get the rifle. Room. And that is a watchtower that, again, they have embiggened to a ridiculous size and made part of the background. Although, wouldn't it be weird if it wasn't a watchtower? It was just like a well that, you know, had a nice silhouette to it. I know this is a thing that's not going to happen, but how entertaining would it be if my bonus for beating X part of the game was, all right, now do that level again, only now you have a submachine gun and just go nuts on these people. I would be very entertained. I gotta say, so, noteworthy differences about this from other Anpa.us Racing Brothers titles. Uh, there's definitely a, uh, like, again, the less painful combat is fantastic. Uh, machine Hunt? Oh my god, that thing was so irritating. This, like I said, uh, basically painless. Kaboom. Okay. I just noticed the revolver bullets are going through more than one enemy at once. And I'm really enjoying, again, the, the simple way that these enemies just fall to pieces. Well, fly apart, really, when you shoot them. I just, the... Uh... Wow. That was pretty, pretty stupid. Which is what they were going for, so I can't complain that they, they got just right. Alright, uh, where is he? The map is weirdly useful. The way it does give you an accurate sense of what the place is like. I, a lot of map... I'll, I'll, oh, no, 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 no! That was embarrassing. A lot of um, maps in these sorts of games, right, are not as useful as this one. Seriously, just a scorpion? You're getting weirdly I less creative with bosses as the game goes on. The first thing the monster did was make me pay in advance. Wow, that was rough to hear. Two more levels, people! And we are done west of red? Lord of Darkness is impressed with your 
good soul, you will give your life back. Okay. Sure. What the hell, right? Is that is that it? Alright, I'm gonna go get that rifle. And then we'll uh check out what the new objective is. Probably the church or maybe the sheriff. Yep, church. So I think it was a glitch that brought me to the church when I was done. Thank you. Got my nice, uh... Is it a Henry rifle or is it just a, uh... Alright, there's... Oh, I'm gonna try something. Okay, now I'm actually gonna feed in five bullets. No, I am not. Well, the odds of there being super realistic ro reloading animations were not fantastic. Still, I'm glad they uh, put in these Western rifles. Although I feel like I've seen a couple of these Western weapons in other of their games. I want my souls back, the voice keeps repeating. Again, I have not got 511 kills. If you are here, who I don't know what that number is based on. Wait, am I the devil? I am so confused right now. Have I been the devil this whole time? Oh no, wait, he was just being sarcastic. And that's just uh, one of his quote-unquote clever cliche sayings. That actually didn't look bad. Uh, no, I mean, I know this is, uh, this is not a very high bar, but... This might be the best Anpa US Racing Brothers game. I'm definitely enjoying it the most. Like, the, uh, coherent plot structure is definitely helping. I mean, the gameplay hasn't really evolved, but just the fact that, you know, they're actually giving you objectives and giving you some sort of a narrative on which to hang this action... You know, rather than, uh... I don't know if you played... Oh, whoops. Sorry, I was trying to jump over him, but I forgot I didn't have super jump. Are we already down to two? That's great. I bet they're running away from me. Yeah, I really think super jump is the only perk. So anyway, as I was saying, uh... Yeah, it's the first game of theirs that has, like, this legit... Structure. That was quite a sound effect. I think it has nothing... Jesus. That's eerie. I don't think women should be allowed to have kids after 40. 40 kids is way too much by any standard. Wow. Okay, now we've met a boss that has a ridiculous amount of health. Alright, we'll just reload while sprinting away from him. Thank you kindly. Alright, here we go. Oh, hey, let's shotgun to finish him off. If I want your opinion, I'll ask you to fill out the necessary forms. Yeah, they give me an extra 500 experience points. I don't know that experience points are doing anything, though. Just just spending all my time shooting demons and watching them explode? Is that is that my... Uh, actually going to fight Satan here at the end. Hey, now we're up in the bar! Upstairs in the bar is obviously what I meant to say there. Alright, so... You just can't walk any further. The sheriff's office? I guess is what you're trying to get me to say? Oh, I love that sound effect. Just gonna grab you one more time. You'd think that would mean something or have an effect on something, but it doesn't. Yeah, these pick upable items are very weird. I keep expecting something to happen because I'm picking them up, but nothing ever does. It's like they got halfway 
to add it, making an adventure portion of this game, and that's it. Still, again, I respect the extra work they've put in. They've got... Yeah, after I... Sometimes I just stop. You know? Like, it, it is more functional than any other Anpa US game I've played. What is this? They all belong to me. Bring them back. Who are we talking about? Bombs don't kill people. Explosions kill people. And now, Japanese Gate. The, uh... The thing that they have made hu a huge part of the, uh... Uh... I want to say... Geography. Or I guess level geometry would also work. Saying wise. Please die. Okay, so 42. I'm going to try and shoot a bunch of guys at once and see if I can... Yeah, no, you can kill multiple guys at once without any trouble in this game. Especially when there's huge crowds of them, which is what's happening right now. Also, no slowdown in this. Like, earlier Anpa.us Racing Brothers games had been so poorly optimized that the bad guys were chugging all over the screen, but... You know, here, it's all pretty smooth. I mean... That's not to say that there's any great animation. There obviously isn't. Please die. Am I ambivalent? Well, yes and no. They really... I mean, there's only five levels in the game. You could have come up with a couple of more things for him to say. Alright, where's this bad guy? Ah, there he is. It's just a demon, everybody. Just a regular, everyday demon. Uh, he's named... Devil. Okay. I find it hard to believe that I'm a skeptic. Oh. I mean, even for this one, that was... This game, that was pretty bad. We did it! Yes! We've completed the campaign! And learned a lot about ourselves in the process. <laughs> My new oh. year's resolution is to stop procrastinating. Next. Wow. Oh, I get what he was saying there. My new year's resolution is to stop procrastinating next year. Is the joke there? Because he, he's going to procrastinate on that resolution a whole year. I guess I didn't need to explain that joke. So if I kill these 30, it's just going to restart survival mode indefinitely, right? Like, we're going to test that, but I, I think the game is over. You'll note it did not have an ending. Uh, although, uh, it's not like Blood Feed had an ending either. I think Dinosaur Hunt might have had an ending. Although I do not, re I mean, I'll be honest, I do not remember. Hey, what was the one where you were a Viking who killed robots? Alright, here we go. So the enemies in this game are... Imp. Devil. Scorpion. Spider. And a single Naga. And honestly, only one spider, too. So basically, imps, devils, and scorpions are pretty much it for this game, right? Ah! Not a bad... Well, I mean, it's not a great assemblage. and It is clearly a, a hell-themed thing. You think they could have uh, tacked a couple of more demons on there, you know? Just for... To keep things interesting. I accidentally just killed three guys with a single shot. Thus suggesting the game is not spending too much time worrying about realistic ballistics. Also, I don't know what experience means, because I'm certainly not leveling up or unlocking things. And literally the only perk I've ever seen is Super Jump. Although they might count healing as a perk, in which case I've seen two perks. Are we done? We're basically done, right? Yeah, we're done. There's going to be a boss, though, I assume. 
Kaboom. I started with nothing, and I still have most of it. Oh, God. All right, here's the boss. Wow. Yeah, they've really got to do something about the part of every level where the boss is supposed to show up and then you spend a full 45 seconds to a minute waiting for the boss to show up because they spawn in the boss at the edge of the map and they use huge maps. Like, ridiculously large maps. Oh. Oh, here we go. We're now at least in the vicinity of him. We exist roughly in the same temporal plane as him. Although, I gotta say, it kind of looks like... Oh, it's the serpent again! I've missed you, buddy! How you been? You had uh, not enough lead in you? Oh my god, he is shockingly slow. They've really uh, jacked up his health for this second fight, haven't they? Can I hold down the button to rapid fire? Well, not rapid fire, but continuously shoot? I cannot. Good work, developers. Green is my favorite color. I love it more than blue and yellow combined. Oh my god, that's a terrible joke. Alright, it's just going to take me back to another uh, thing, right? Just a random level. Love is like a fart. All right. If you have so. To force it, it's probably shit. Oh God, what is wrong with you? All right. Enemy HP bar, unlimited ammo, infinite health, perks, ammo drops, health drops, cliche voice comments. Do 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 do. Uh, let's just turn everything down. I just want to get um footage of the saloon. Just, you know, because I want to do a video of all the times I've seen that saloon. Anyway, uh, I have been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming along on this journey with me to, I'm going to say it, the best ANPA US Racing Brothers game I've ever played. Like, this is, uh, I, I will. This is by far their best, most coherent title. It's not very long. There's just five levels, but you actually have to do a sane thing to get there. There's a consistency to the concept, like you're playing as an Old West guy and you just have Old West weapons. And you're, I mean, the concept of the game is you're an Old West guy fighting demons in hell. And they've got, they've built themselves a Western set. They've built it with Western props. Right? And you're only using Western weapons. So, like, this is a level of, like, logic, continuity, and uh, a clarity of purpose that I have never seen in one of their games before. And it shows that they're improving and doing more interesting things. I don't know why I can pick up these items and music plays. It's not like it's, it's a fully featured story and game, but it's a step in the right direction. Now that's what I'm going to say. So, uh, if you would like to see more from me, there's going to be buttons coming up uh, for subscribing and checking out a video that YouTube thinks you might like. I will see you back here. Oh, right. Questions and suggestions get dropped in the comment section. I will see you back here for more of Hoguru's journey into madness as I play all the anpa.us games. But until then, au revoir.